Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do a clean with me video. And first I'm just gonna show you all of our hot mess of a house. It gets dirty so fast. This was right after lunch, so everything is a complete disaster. And yes, I do clean every day, but somehow, I don't know, we have a whole circus as a family and the place gets turned upside down in about 30 seconds. So, Come join me as I clean this nasty, disgusting house and make it something livable. The first room we're gonna start in is Max's room and both of the kids are very good helpers when it comes to cleaning up their room. They just need a little help or positive reinforcement sometimes, but Max loves to clean up his messes, so here he is, cute as a button, helping me pick up all his toys. You'll notice throughout this video that when I make the beds, Max's bed is the only one that I actually change the sheets. And that is because he's three, not 100% potty trained and still has accidents at night. Even if he's wearing a pull up, somehow it leaks out. So we have to change his sheets all the time. Does anyone else's dog attack the vacuum every single time? I don't know why, it never fails, but I think it's hilarious. Next up, we're moving on to Ella's room, and it's usually not that bad, but recently she's been trying to sneak in my pots and pans and real food to try to play restaurant in here. So I don't really know what I'm gonna do about that, but I guess just let her be a four-year-old for now. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I usually just shove most of her toys in her closet and shut the door, cause she's just gonna get them back out in five minutes anyways.
Moving on to the center of the home and definitely the messiest part of the house, the kitchen. Like I said, this was right after lunch and I mean, it's just turned upside down. There's a million dirty dishes to do, the dining room table's a mess, and there's just random stuff everywhere. I made this video in hopes that it would inspire you to clean along with me or maybe motivate you to get up and tackle whatever messes are around your house. I know as a mom, it's hard enough to keep our head above water as it is, much less take care of all the day-to-day -day messes. So get up, tackle whatever mess you need to do so you can take the rest of the day off and just focus on your kids and snuggle those babies. I also made this video just to keep it real with you guys and show you that nobody's life is perfect, everyone deals with messes, and everyone's house looks like a pigsty sometimes. But I want to be here to motivate you guys and to maybe share some of those struggles with you because we can get through this as moms together. And I have to know, do you guys wash your Tupperware by hand or do you put it in the dishwasher? For some reason, I put the lids in the dishwasher, but I wash the Tupperware by hand because every time I put it in the dishwasher, it seems that it messes it up a little. So I don't know, maybe it's my dishwasher. What do you guys do?
power through. I'm struggling. Finally, the last room of the day is the master bedroom. This is also kind of a catch-all room. The kids like to come in here and throw off their shoes and their clothes and bring all their toys in here. So you can clearly see that the laundry likes to pile up too, but let's go ahead and get started. I find that making the bed first makes the whole room feel cleaner and it makes the whole process a little bit easier.
And that is it guys for our first cleaning video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope it motivated you and I really hope to see you soon in my next one.